Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So we have a little bit of a different background today because I am coming at all of you from the beautiful sunny city of Los Angeles. So I'm spending a few days in LA and San Diego with my boyfriend and later on some friends are gonna meet us in the week. But I thought it would be super fun to show you guys kind of what I packed. Because let's be real, we all were a little scared that summer was gonna be canceled. And now that it's not, I'm like, where's my style inspiration? I have been bumming it so hard the past few months that I didn't even know what to wear. So I wanted to come up with this video so y'all can get some really cute summer ideas. Also my birthday's on Saturday, which is July 4th, so. I definitely need to show out a little bit for that. So I got some cute outfits in here, some chill outfits in here, a couple going out style outfits, even though I probably won't be going out like that because, <coughs> you know? So I'm not even gonna waste any more of your time talking about whatever. You guys can go ahead and subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up if you like some of the clothes and you wanna see more videos by me. Also, don't forget to follow me on the gram. I will put that down here or down here somewhere. And let's just jump right into this video. Okay, so the first outfit that I'm gonna start with is the one that I'm wearing right now. Back up a little bit so you guys can kind of see what's going on. This top right here is a bodysuit. It is from PLT. I really like the sleeves on this and also the, what do you call these? The little buckle things? Sorry, I don't know. But this is a really cute detail plus the little tie at the top right here very very cute very feminine very girly and then we have it with these jeans right here that i'm pretty sure are from fashion nova if they're not i'll just put it on on the screen but i'm like 90 percent sure they're from fashion nova and then this really cute blingy belt right here which is from misguided So I feel like depending on how you do the rest of this outfit, this is good for almost anything. You can go out to lunch in this, you can go shopping in this, just kind of chilling, walking about in this. Or you could dress it up a little more with some heels and stuff like that and have a cute little wine tasting party. Going wine tasting, that sounds really fun. But yeah, so this is really cute. Alright guys, so this is outfit number two, way more chill, probably going to wear this when we go shopping tomorrow. Just a simple little tube top, this one is from Pretty Little Thing, I would suggest getting one from somewhere else because this is really thin and see through. Very cheap, but honestly I wish it was thicker. And then we've got this little midi skirt from Forever 21. Y'all know when Forever 21 has stuff like this, it is super cost effective, but still cute, and it'll make your butt look good. So I'm just paired this with some sneakers, <laughs> just some white ones, and wait for it, and then suddenly I'm a Kardashian. Ooh. What? <laughs> That was uncalled for. <laughs> I love these sunnies right here. They are so cool. They make me feel like a boss ass. You know what? And these are from Fashion Nova. They were like six bucks, I want to say. So super cheap. Check them out. All right, so next up we have another skirt, but this one is a little denim skirt. And this itty bitty little cute tank right here. I'm realizing that there is a lot of white that I brought with me and still more white pieces of clothing to come. But anyways, this skirt I really like. I like the little zigzag on the hem. It is Kendall and Kylie. I think you can get this from Paxson. I'm pretty sure you can get this from PacSun. And then this little tank top is from PLT. I usually actually use this as a little bikini cover-up, 
So maybe actually this little outfit will be something that I wear to the beach. This is what it's like from the back. Pretty cute, pretty cute. And since this will probably be the beach fit, I'll probably just pair it with some little sandals and some sunnies. All right, since that last outfit reminded me of the beach, we'll go into bikinis now. So I only have three to show you guys because I bought another one, but it didn't look that good on me. I might show it to you anyways, just to show you guys. But I've got this one right here. Like the pattern on this, you can tie the straps on both of the sides. So you can control how tight and lifted you want to look. I think if you have bigger boobs than I do, this top will look really good on you. And then also, since you can tie them, you can switch these up. You can tie this one across this side or you can crisscross them. I really like to crisscross them. I'll put a picture up somewhere of me doing that because I think that's actually my favorite way to wear this bikini. And then these are the bottoms. They're just a little bit of a tie too. And it looks like this. And then of course, you've always got to have some cool shades on, so. These right here, I love these ones. These are from Nordstrom. And if I didn't mention it already, this bikini is from Zaffle. All right, so the next bikini is another stringy one. It is this really pretty blue color, which I love so much. This bikini is from Misguided. And kicker, it was even cheaper than the Zaffa one. This one was eight bucks total. It was four for the bottom and four for the top. I'm really liking string bikinis this year and this style of bottom. I'm really liking how the top has no pads in it and stuff, so you can kind of like adjust how much coverage you want. You can bring it a little in or out if you want to. These are another pair of sunglasses that I have. They're just some basic rose gold aviators, also from Misguided. They've been having really dope sales lately, especially if you are a student. I just graduated with my master's, Oops, so I'm still using that student discount. I love this bikini so much, I'm thinking about picking it up in other colors because it's also so cheap. And I want to say it's also made out of recycled materials, but don't necessarily quote me on that. Also, this is a thong woman, so, you know, if you're a thong girl, you're a booty girl, this is your bikini all right so this is gonna be the last bikini that I'm showing you guys it is brand new it's from Fashion Nova still got the tag on it I'm just trying it on so since I just bought this I can tell you that it is called the Maldives dream long sleeve bikini I got it in this bright pink color for right now I'm just wearing it with these shorts because if I was going somewhere I would probably just throw on some shorts with it since this is already kind of like a top. These shorts are from Fashion Nova too, I think. I have a lot of stuff from there, huh? Hmm. <sighs> also, I feel like I shouldn't have to feel like I need to say this, but I did just, of course I took, of course I took a break right before I put all the bikinis on and I ate food. Body positivity, ladies, okay? I am still happy with myself even after I've eaten like two meals. Even though, I'm not gonna lie, I do wish I would have done this on an empty stomach, but whatever, it's fine. I still look great. So this is the full bikini. The top is really cute. The sleeves are mesh. That's something I didn't really pick up on when I bought this, but just so you know, the sleeves are mesh. And then the bottoms are literally just simple pink bottoms. So you could really wear them with anything. You could switch up the top color too if you wanted. That's what it looks like from the back. And I might wear this with my, or I might wear this as like my birthday bikini, if you will, just because it's the only one that I have that's more of a 
you know, a fashion-y swimsuit. Like, obviously, you don't go swimming in this, you know? And also, I got some press-on nails that are going to match this perfectly. And you know what? People are getting on that press-on nail hype now because of, you know what? I can't say it on YouTube, but you know what I'm talking about. And, like, low-key, I've been on that because... I don't know if there's anyone like me out there. I hate getting my nails done. I don't like what acrylic does to my nails. And also, I don't know, I've just had plenty of bad nail experiences getting like cut by the thing that goes bzzz or like people just doing them bad or making them crooked, like just crazy stuff. And I also, I've, like I just got my masters and I always had to type a lot and long nails are not practical. Like I just needed nails for like a week or so when I have a time, like right now, like my birthday where I want to be cute and then like pop them right off. So press-ons are perfect for me. I'm going to show you the nails that I got though because they cute. They cute. Okay, so the nails that I got, they're from Kiss. I'm sure you, you can find that brand everywhere, Target, CVS, wherever, Ulta. And I got these right here oh okay i'm missing them here so they pretty cute and they're called gel fantasy so yeah they come in the package they look like this oh <laughs> and they are gonna match this bikini really good so that kind of worked out really awesome because i was gonna wear these anyways regardless of this bikini all right, so this is the next outfit. We've got this rust-colored shirt and white jeans. I usually actually wear this top with black jeans, but I feel like I literally always wear black jeans and I needed to just give them a rest, so I opted for white this time. And honestly, I'm not even sure how I feel about it. I'm just gonna be real. But it's like cute, it's not a bad outfit, but I'm not sure that it's my fave. But this top right here is from Windsor, and these jeans are from Fashion Nova. I actually don't like these jeans that much, I just feel like they don't fit really great, I don't know. They're just, they're not my favorite pair of jeans. But I did feel like I needed some white in my life, so here we are. All right, so now we're gonna move into some stuff that's a little dressier. And we're starting off with this little number right here from PLT. This is a little Asian inspired dress. It's very, very cute. It's very, very cheaply made. This material literally feels like I could just go like this and rip this dress in half. So that's kind of uncool, but it looks pretty cute. My boyfriend actually bought this for me for Christmas and I just haven't like had anything to wear it to so I just brought it this time just in case. This is what it looks like. It's pretty cute. I'm going to try to speed through the rest of this video because I feel like I've been doing this for forever and if you have been watching my channel you know your girl's comp prepping right now so I actually need to hurry up and go get my cardio done for the day. Right, so the next dress that we have is this one right here. It's florally, has like some puffy sleeves. Super, super cute. It's from Misguided. I got this dress in a size six, but I really wish I would have gotten it in a four because it looks good and it looks like it fits me well, but I, when I have tighter dresses, I just want them to hug right, you know? And this one, it just, it don't do that for me, really. But it's still really cute. I guess I'll keep her. I'm thinking this will probably be the dress I wear if I go out to eat with my boyfriend for my birthday or something. So, and I imagine this, I feel like I'll have my hair straightened and have it half up with like these cute earrings that I got and I have a vision for it. Also, saying all of that, if you wanna see how I officially style all of these outfits, Make sure you're following me on Instagram because that's where you're going to see all the good stuff. And also, honestly, I'm not going to show you guys every single little thing that I brought with me because I just filled up like a small suitcase and just threw a bunch of stuff in it because I was being la a lazy packer and decided I'd figure out my outfits when I'm here. 
So this video is helping me do that. <laughs> so I know what I'm gonna wear for the week. But seriously, if you do wanna see how I actually put everything together, follow me on the gram so you can check it out. All right, you guys, so this two-piece set right here is gonna be the last thing that I show you today. So it is a satin white top and bottom. Very cute, actually pretty stretchy and comfy for something like this. I feel like the skirt does red up a little bit, so maybe you wanna wear a little shorts or something underneath it. But this is really cute and super easy to make really, really fancy. I feel like if this was more New Year's time, I would put a fur coat over it, be super bougie like that. But since it's warmer outside, I don't know, I kind of want to find maybe like a pop of bling or a pop of color to wear with this. I have some neon heels that maybe I'll pair with it. I don't know yet. I don't know. But I have ideas and this set is absolutely adorable. From Fashion Nova, size small. I realize I didn't really say the sizes of anything, but I'll have it all down below, so don't freak out. Don't you worry, I got you, okay? So don't freak out, don't trip. But this is cute. So if I want to look a little bouge, I guess, this is what I'm most likely gonna be throwing on for that. Okay, you guys, so that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, do not forget to thumbs up this video. Subscribe to my channel and follow your girl on Instagram, okay? Don't forget none of that. And be on the lookout for my next videos because it's going to be more about my comp prep journey, which I am so excited to share with you all. This is something that I've been wanting to do for a little bit now, and I'm finally just jumping the gun and doing it, and I cannot wait to live out this journey. It's going to be so amazing, and I can't wait to see how far I can push myself within the next few months. So make sure you watch that. Make sure you follow me to see how I style my outfits. And with that being said, I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.